All right, guys, we're here today to talk about your sprinkler system. So just to go through the unit and go through and show you what each setting does. First setting, current time of day. That's going to give you your month, your year, and time of the day. It's important to keep the calendar going so you get your days correctly on your water cycle. The next two settings are the most important settings. Start time. Start time is how you turn your whole sprinkler system on. Your sprinkler system and your yard are divided into three or four zone settings. The start time turns the whole system on. The run time is how long each zone runs. Each house is different. There are two types of sprinkler heads that we use. We use misting heads and we use rotating heads. The misting heads will be used in flower beds and small areas. The rotating heads will be used to cover larger areas and will require a longer run time. For example, flower beds will be a short five to 10 minute run time depending on the coverage area. The bigger areas of the yard, such as the backyard, could be as much as 15 to 25 minutes depending on the size of the yard and the coverage area. Next up, Water days. During the warmer months and going all the way into the fall, you want to keep a every other day water cycle. Those cycles will only be interrupted by multiple days of rain. On the water days, if you see a circle with a line through it, that means the water is not watering your yard that day. The days that are on are clearly indicated by a raindrop with no circle or line. Another function of the system is the manual one station. The manual one station can be used to touch up water or to add water to certain sections of your yard or to check your sprinkler heads. To use this system, you simply turn the setting to manual one station. You look at what zone is indicated in the top left corner and the amount of time that it will run in on the right side. From manual one station, you choose the zone, let it blink three times, turn to run, and the system will come on. To end the run time, simply go back to off and it will turn your system off. When you have wet periods, turn the system off. Give it a break. When it quits raining, Simply go back to the run, and the program you have set will go right back to work. Hey guys, we hope the video series is a valuable resource for you. If you have any more questions, refer to the information below.